everyone, my name's Christian and welcome to my channel. It's time to discuss Cardano. If you love Cardano as much as I do, make sure to smash that like button. Many of you may know me as an entrepreneur, real estate investor, and tech founder, but ever since I discovered Cardano, it excites me more than anything in recent memory. I've decided to dedicate a lot more time on my channel to everything Cardano. And although I'll probably discuss other blockchain projects because the world of crypto is ever changing and it's extremely exciting, I believe that Cardano will change the world. And I want a front row seat when we blast off. Although there is no single blockchain to rule them all. There are a lot of coins and tokens that have little or no utility, and it took me a lot of time to determine which blockchain projects hold the most potential as we dive into Web 3.0. Cardano continues to impress me, and the Cardano community is the best. Always remember, it's the people behind the projects that lead to success. Charles Hoskinson, the founder of Cardano, has been a huge advocate for the little guy and he continues his mission-driven vision to help everyone everywhere with digital identity, education, connectivity, and the ability to enter the global economy with peer-to-peer -peer lending and banking the unbanked. I started my company in February of 2015 with a dream of delivering economic identity to those who don't have it. The reality is the world lives still in two different configurations one for the developed and one for the developing. In the developed world, there are many things we take for granted. The fact that it's easy for us to have an identity, passports, driver's licenses, it's easy for us to travel. It's easy for us to prove our credit worthiness and get credentials. It's easy for us to borrow money, get insurance, and to process payments. For example, if someone does a service for you, you can Venmo them something, you can send them a PayPal transaction. We take this for granted and for the most part, it's part of our daily lives, just like breathing or drinking water. But when you live in the developing world, it's a very different prospect. It's very difficult to globalize. It's difficult to prove claims, whether you're producing something with fair trade or in a sustainable way. It's difficult for people to receive money and send money. These remittance transactions on average carry an eight to 15% fee. When a person wants to borrow money, if it's even possible, these microfinance transactions can have interest rates as high as 85% according to the World Bank. And the reason this exists is not because of avarice or because of racism or some unpronounced evil in the global order. Rather, it's because of systems. Some countries enjoy systems that are structurally superior to other systems. And the problem is that the legacy systems that we have are fundamentally incompatible with total globalization without admitting total centralization behind one standard, such as the American way or the Chinese way. The world is beyond that. This is no longer the 20th century. This is the 21st century, a century with the iPhone, a century with the internet, a century where information moves instantaneously. And as a consequence, we have a better way of governing the world order. We no longer need central entities. We no longer need central governments. Just like the internet, the things that can process our payments, our contractual relationships, hoist up our identity, our property, and permit the gears of commerce to work can be done through the very same technology that has enabled innovations like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Cardano. Charles continues his mission-driven vision, and I want to go into the Cardano metaverse with him. If you'd like to come along, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and ping that notification bell so that you can be notified when I release any additional content. Also, if there's any specific video that you'd like to see, please leave a comment down below. I look forward to hearing from you.